Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You have a calendar feature that allows you to see company information, such as when bills are due, in a calendar layout. You can open the calendar by clicking the Calendar button in the QuickBooks toolbar, by clicking the Calendar icon within the home page, or by selecting Company and then choosing the Calendar command from the menu bar. Within the calendar, you can see the current date selected within a month style layout. For the selected date, you can also see the transactions that were entered, bills due, and other company transactions shown in a listing at the bottom of the calendar window. To the right of the calendar, you can see a listing of upcoming transaction items that are due, such as to-do items and bills, as well as past due items. Note that you can open any items shown within these areas by simply double-clicking on them to open the original transaction window. At the top of the calendar is a toolbar that you can use to change the dates displayed. You can use the left and right pointing arrows to move through the months that are shown. The name of the currently displayed month and year is then shown within the toolbar. If you wish to jump back to select the current date, you can click the Today button within the toolbar. You can change the layout of the calendar by clicking either the Daily View, Weekly View, or Monthly View buttons. If you wish to select a particular date within the calendar, you can either click on the date shown in the calendar view or you can select a date from the Select a Date Calendar drop-down shown in the toolbar at the top of the window. You can also filter the transactions shown within the calendar by using the Show drop-down. The choice selected by default is All Transactions. However, you can also choose to view only selected transactions by making a choice from this drop-down menu. When you are finished viewing the calendar window, Simply close it by clicking the small x in the upper right corner of the window or by pressing the escape key on your keyboard. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.